Come on, Roderick is waiting for me. We see everything, and no one sees us. The world has forgotten this castle. It's not an Inquisition guard, but at least I'll be able to continue training. Let's go take a look. This, at least, I know how to do. There you go. Well, that was... efficient. And almost painless. Come on, let's go. Whoa. Can you feel that? No. What? When you enter a place that has been abandoned for a very long time, there's something in the air. Yes, dust. No, the stones. It's like interrupting a conversation. <sighs> this is the first time I've felt it here. Hmm. That looks dangerous. Let's avoid it for now. Another door. Shall we continue? Of course. Let's see where this leads us. Oh, the courtyard. It's a shortcut. <sighs> oh, hey, I almost forgot. I found something while I was doing some clearing earlier. Come take a look. Another story about stones? Actually, you're not far off. I'm coming. A fresco. It's strangely familiar. It includes the symbols of the pillars. This castle has things to tell us, huh? And what is it telling us then? Even I don't understand everything. I just think we'll be fine here. Amicia! Come quickly! It's Hugo! Oh no. I'm coming! Need me? Uh, I'll call you. Come on! Come on! I'm here, Lucas! Quickly! Hugo, please. It's getting worse and worse. The macula is progressing too fast. I realize that, Amicia. I'm doing my best. I... I mean, I'm trying to do what the book says, but it's going to take too long. I need a proper laboratory. Like Laurentius had? No. No. One with better equipment. Well, perhaps my mother, at my home, she must have had some equipment there. You're right. It's worth a try. Alicia! Lucas! I believe your twins are back. Melly! You found him! More... dead than alive. But yes. Amicia, we... we came because... well... Yes. Arthur, you tell her. After our little adventure with your heretic burning friends, I ended up in an Inquisition cell. One day I saw the guards accompany a prisoner who looked the worse for wear. Those bastards wanted her to tell them where her son was, so... They threatened her. And I heard her name. 
Beatrice Starro. Mother is alive. She's alive. You managed to get Arthur out. It wasn't simple. Believe me. So you could... Forget it. I was nothing. But she... She's too important to the Grand Inquisitor. He, uh... Questions her a lot. They torture her? Hugo mustn't know anything of this. Even that she's alive? It might help him. And what will we say when he wants to see her? Tell him nothing, all right? Ah! Oh no! Hugo! Hugo! Ah! Ah! The next threshold, ah! it's coming. We have to go at once, to my home, now. Hugo, we'll stay here with him. It will be all right, my little brother. I swear, this time we will heal you. All right, I'll get the Sanguinis Genera and some potions, and then we'll leave. We're here. Amicia, you're going to be all right? Yes. It's just strange to be back. Let's go. I never thought I'd come back here. Not so soon. We find the potions and we leave. We might even get home before sunrise. Fine by me. Mm, we can't cross there. That bridge was at least a century old. Everything looks completely destroyed. It's the end of the old world. If that's true, how come you're so calm? Look, the standard of the Inquisition. Are they still there? Let's be careful. Don't fall. Don't fall. What the hell is that? Look out, Lucas. What the... What's the matter with them? I don't know, but I don't like it. Let's get out of here. They're not even paying attention to us. Lucas, we'll deal with that later. Come on. There must be a reason. Hugo and I ran away. I remember something attacked the gods. I think it's thanks to the rats that we were able to escape that day. I, I see. This must be one of the first places they came from. But it doesn't explain their behavior. They're not welcome here. I'll show them. This is my home. Do you hear me? My home.
Mongol rats. The domain is straight ahead. Side. Wait, the lantern. We must have used it to get the troops through. Good idea. I'll have a clear shot. You can go back down. Tell me when you're ready. I'm there. Here we go. You can move. Keep it on me, all right? I think I'd make it here without you. That system works really well. I'm ready. Don't forget me. alone. Oh. A guard. He's still alive. Someone help me. The rats. You tell me how many of you are there? Oh, it hurts. I don't want to die. Not like this. Like this? You executed my family. You deserve a painful death. Please, have mercy. Don't you ever use that word. I'm not going to get anything useful out of him. The daughter of Robert and Beatrice de Roux. Oh, no. Please. Please have mercy. Shut up. I'm leaving you to your fate.
They're already dead, and I already have enough blood on my hands. Oh, my home. That the body over there. No, no, please. Amicia, we can stop. Find another way. No, I have to see. Is he your father? So, you saved our lives. We'll celebrate later. We need to get to the chamber. It's that window up there. We should take the torch. Don't worry. I'll lead the way. Thank you. Sorry, Alicia. Please, let me rest in peace. That body with no armor. It's one of our servants, but his body. Yes, the guards were eaten alive, but he wasn't. Why? There must be a reason. If only I knew. The great break, its aftershocks continue to ripple through time. What on earth is going on here?
Or is it your father's? Yes. From his days fighting alongside King Philip. He was a great knight. Then he won't be forgotten. Here we are. It's up there. Whoa, look out. They're all converging here. They're going towards his room. The potions for Hugo must be in there. Lucas, those pots? Simple infusions. Not strong enough. There must be others. So, this is it? Yes, it's Hugo's room. Let's go. Everything... Everything's like it was before. No, that's not it. Neither's this. No, Lucas. or this. Why hasn't his room been touched? No, no, no. It's not here. Still no luck? No. They're, they're, these are normal standard potions. Your mother must have been working on a more complex elixir. There has to be something else. Another place, another what room. did I you know? You can't just make an opus magnum like that. She must have a laboratory somewhere. I don't know. I don't see where. Laurentius, he built his laboratory away from prying eyes. So your mother must have also... She told me nothing. I never but saw her. But that's it. Isn't there a place where she didn't want you to go? I don't know. Some well, place she protected. The old Roman ruins. She didn't want me to go there. The Roman ruins? Yes. Definitely an idea from an alchemist. Exactly where are they? The garden. Let's go. Close. Get a move on. They might come back. I'm scared out of my skin, Misia. I'm here with you, but we have to keep moving. Lord, it's even worse than I thought. Everything is dead. Where are the baths? 
Over there, at the other end. We have to get through that. But how? I know. We'll... We'll... We'll get there. A flower. Intact. A sinkful, I think. Hugo wouldn't have wanted us to leave it here. Ready to run. Ready. Run! Come on, go! Come on, come on! Don't miss! It's all right. I don't believe it. Look at them. Like a river. A river of rats. It's the only way to get to the baths. Wait, the cart. We can relight the fire and push it. No, I'll light it and you push it. What? All by myself? You saw what happened earlier. You think they're just going to let us pass like that? All right. All right. Get your ammunition ready, because we haven't done all this for nothing. Come on, Lucas. Let's go. We'll be, we'll be. Lucas, you see, you're pretty tough. Yes, but I don't think I'll ever walk again. Oh, come on. I don't know what my mother hid under there, but you don't want to miss it, do you? Oh, no. Come on. 
Let's go. Lucas, this is it. This is where I saw my mother die. But Arthur said she is still alive, didn't he? Yes. But this is poor Lambert. He must have taken the hit instead of her. She... She is still alive, but... But they... I know. Think of your brother. We have to carry on. These stairs. It takes me back to my childhood. Well, that's good. Because we're going to need your memories from back then. My mother never wanted me to come down here. She said it was dangerous. Dangerous for her, I bet. You never found anything? No. And I was really good at searching. There are two of us this time. And we're not a child anymore. We'll find it. Lucas, look, it looks like the bite. A Roman fresco. It looks like Justinian's plague. Laurentius told me about it. A real massacre. Worse than now? Hard to tell. It was back in the 6th century. Lucas, these baths were built by a Roman governor in the 6th century. This fresco isn't here by chance. Neither are we. Let's push this. Yes, of course. Help me push. Very well. So this is the Sudatorium. The Romans came here to sweat. With the steam? Yes. It was... Oh, look! The sculptures! What? Alchemical animals, putrefaction, purification, amalgamation and sublimation. The symbol in the basin represents putrefaction as well. These symbols used to fascinate me. There are more in the other two basins. Three symbols, four sculptures, 
There's a fire under that one, so we can probably light the others too. Mm. There must be a way to get to them. The snake. It gave me a few nightmares, that one. The toad. <laughs> as ugly as ever. The swan. Imposing and graceful. Lucas, another fresco. A pregnant woman. But that's not all. Look, next to her. It's some sort of alembic, right? She's an alchemist? Exactly. Alchemy has often been compared to impregnation, and the crucible or kiln to the uterus. Uh, or maybe she's just a pregnant alchemist. Not just. This temple is your mother's. And it's not just a coincidence that this is a woman. It's an important place. You're probably right. There, near the symbol. The flap has caved in. I think you can get past. I'll go down. Stay here. All right. Great! Hey, what does it look like down there? A nest! They're all around me, and I, I can't see a thing. Right, let's go. I'll try to guide you. And how do you intend to do that? The light. I'll wait close to the basin. Good luck. Coming back! Here. Laurentius taught me about the world through books. 
But reality is something else entirely, huh? That's the worst of it. None of this seems to be real at all. <laughs> Composition, purification, and sublimation. Toad, swan, and serpent. So... So our friend the lion is hiding a secret. He needs mouth, perhaps? Help us, mother. Go on. You discovered her secret, Amicia. You've earned this. Save your ammo. I'll take care of it. So, what do you see? Complementary products, stabilizers, reagents, noble materials, vastly superior to what we saw in the bedroom. This is it, Amicia. Good. Good. <laughs> Amicia, these notes are handwritten by a mother. Tried a new transformation, but the elixir is incomplete. The torch of the carrier disappears. Leaving my son in the darkness of the macula. She was on the right track, Amicia. What we're looking for is definitely here somewhere. Yeah, but where? What does it look like? Over there. It looks like there's something. Another fresco. A child in the arms of its mother. But these marks on its torso, Lucas. The prima macula. But this fresco is at least eight centuries old. And yet this has happened before. But how many times? Who knows? Sanguinis Itinera, the voyages of the blood, the macula travels through history. It's already changed the world and will do so again. This, this box has a phoenix on it, the symbol of the great alchemical work. Demisia, I think we found it. Open it. All right. Is it my a mother tree? really know how to Yes. Of my family, apparently. It disappeared. It must show how the macula came down to Hugo. And Mother was trying to find it. Lucas! Look! Advanced crystallization. Blue-green edging. Substance clear. What? Lucas! Amber fragrance. Amazing! Spit it out! What on earth is it? The cure for Hugo. 
She was making progress, but she didn't have time to finish it. You mean the same cure that you... Yes, without the book. It's incredible she was able to get this so far. So perhaps we can use it ourselves. With the book and my preparation, I think... I think I may be able to finish it. You seem off to a good start, Magister. Why didn't she tell me? I would have understood. I would have... Ow! I would have done the same thing, Amicia. She was an alchemist, and, you know, her mother protects her children, doesn't she? No, no, not now. How are we going to get out of here? Forget it. Just finish the cure. I'll hold them back. I don't believe it. Why now? Lucas, we have to get a move on. I'm reading. The mother stopped at the sun door. She found the torch. She didn't know how to light. Let's see. It doesn't make sense. They're symbols. She was looking for the missing element. But the book says we must empty the vessel for the spirit to fill it. Your mother was mistaken. We must not add, but subtract. Find me some macerate while I prepare the mix. There has to be some around here. Macerate? What's that? Where will I find it? In the pharmacopoeia. The alcove with the curtain. On my way. Quieten down. Laurentius used to say, calm the beating of your heart, for it is the wish of the heart that the hands express. So calm yourself. It's there. So, do you have the macerate? I can't get there. There are too many. There are too many pots, Lucas. I don't know which ones are which. Find the one that really stinks. Everything stinks. I'm not sure my nose will be able to tell the difference. Whoa. Oh, no. Oh, that is absolute. Look. Lucas, I found it. Perfect. Bring it to me. They're coming back. They're regrouping. That noise. I, I don't like that noise. Ah! Keep going. We nearly there. I'm coming. Put it right. Let's awaken this phoenix. Gently. Stop shaking. No time to waste any. They're coming back! Ah! Ah! Slight alteration in you. Good, but not enough. You said you had to filter something out. So why are you still adding things? You have to add in order to subtract. The bridge, Yermesia! You have to clear a way to the stills for me! All right then, let's get to those stills. Come on. 
Give me your purest alcohol. Bola! The jaw of the sun. The flame of the carrier. Demetia, take me back. Right away. about then please after you Lucas you did it we did it Laurentius would be proud of you I'm proud of you <laughs> thank you at least we know for certain now if the elixir is linked to the rats, that means there's a link to the carrier. Yes, but first things first. We have to save Hugo. Alchemist has worked wonders. <laughs> we have the elixir. I always knew you were a good uh, one. Thanks. Come on. Let's go see Hugo. Hugo! You're not sleeping? Hey, look! We did it! The elixir! Lucas made it! Here you go. It might be a little bitter. Never mind. Drink it in one gulp. Very good. So, am I cured now? Um, well... In any case, you'll soon be a lot better. Misia. Will we never see Mommy again? Oh, Hugo. I told you. She... she won't be coming back. No. And it... and it doesn't hurt where she is? No, no, of course not. Let's all go to bed now, eh? And tomorrow, when you wake up, you'll feel a lot better, you'll see. That's not true. He was in front of the line. <laughs> You're just rubbish. <laughs> oh, you two are arguing again. Ugh. If you don't play by the rules... You're gonna tell me... Hugo! ...about rules. I keep telling Have you. Have you seen Hugo? Oh. <sighs> 
Oh, my head. Uh, gently now, gently. Don't stop. Go on. You go. Where can he have gone? Think, Amicia. Think. Is that a, a, a village here? Hey, wait. Did anyone see a child come through here? Please. Oh, Amicia. Are you feeling better? How is the little one? Clavi? Is, is, is that you? Have you seen Hugo? Did you shout at him again? No, absolutely not. Times are hard enough already without you two arguing. But we weren't arguing anymore. Amicia, a child never runs away without a reason. Open the door. I'm going to find him. All right, but be careful. An ill wind is on its way, Amicia. What is that? What is going on? Amicia, I've been waiting for you. Come with me. Laurentius? Is that really you? Where is Hugo? He... he's gone. <sighs> I knew this would happen. I did take care of him. Then why did he leave? I, I don't know. I... I did everything I could to protect him. Even... horrible things. It is easy to spill blood. But to love, to protect. I'm going to find him. Then go, and pray there is still time. Mommy, I hear a noise outside. Hugo, that's him. Mother? Amicia, come here. Yes, mother. Your brother's here. How is he? If he's back, it's because he's not very well. But I did everything. You hid the truth from him. But... His emotions, Amicia. I warned you. Let me see him. He doesn't want to see you. Who are you talking to, Mommy? I have to see him. He doesn't need you anymore. That's a lie. <sighs> Go on, then. See for yourself. Hugo, are you all right? No. What's the matter? Why did you leave? Why didn't you tell me Mommy was alive? It was for your own good, Hugo. That's not true. You didn't want me to know. Don't say that. You're jealous. Jealous. Let go of me. You go now. Leave me alone. You uh, go. Uh, where are you? you, did they? No. But why did you go off like that? I heard Mommy. She was calling me. It must have been a nightmare, that's all. I really thought it was her. She was in pain, and... She can't feel pain where she is now. We talked about this. But... She's gone, Hugo. You have to accept it. Let's go back. All right. We must get back to the castle.
doing? Come here! No, no Nicholas! Don't touch him! No! Where is your Hugo? sister? Run! Get away from me! There is no one there. It is done. Can I go and see my mother now? Only the Grand Inquisitor may say. But you told me. My words are of no importance. Only those of the Grand Inquisitor. But be sure, you are very precious to him indeed. In a row, I've been on Episangri's duty. When's it gonna end, eh? Soon. The hour of the conjuration of people. But think of Vitalis. Your ordeal is nothing compared to his. Breaking you, I clear your way. The way to the blood of the Chosen One. He is excellent, but the mass of raw Episanguis is decreasing. Our harvesters are being decimated by the rats. Do your best. The life of the Grand Inquisitor depends on the quality of the distillate.
body of the Grand Inquisitor is overwhelmed by the might. I fear it will now attack his mind. Don't worry. The boy's blood will restore the power's equilibrium. May his soul emerge out Ad Ignem. Ad Lucem. Twenty pounds. We have almost reached the objective. I hope so, because that's all we'll be able to produce. It is already a miracle that Vitali's body can take such quantities of Episanguis. His faith protects him. It protects us all. necessary to change the filters and scrape the tanks. Almost reached the objective. I hope so, because that's all we'll be able to produce. It is already a miracle that Vitali's body can take such quantities of Episanguis. His faith protects him, it protects us all. necessary to change the filters and scrape the tanks. <clears throat> Twenty pounds. We have almost reached the objective. I hope so. Because that's all we'll be able to produce. It is already a miracle that Vitali's body can take such quantities of Episanguis. His faith protects him. Hey. Not afraid. Not afraid. I'm going to the city during the conjuration. You on the list? Yeah. I'll be on the square in front of the cathedral. Oh, so you'll be right next to the Grand Inquisitor when he frees us. And I'll be stuck here. We'll all meet again afterwards. The end of the bite. It's going to be quite a party.
Alter. I demand to see Vitalis now. The Grand Inquisitor is very busy. Busy? I am the Archbishop. I represent the Pope. Monseigneur, the mission of the Grand Inquisitor is sacred. His mission was never approved by the Church. I see here only heresy and occultism. And you, you all follow him on this infernal road. Measure your words, Excellency. Your rank should make you more cautious. <sighs> Madness! Don't listen to them. The most important thing is mommy. Magister, the text clearly mentions the ascension of a child during the Great Plague of Justinian. I knew it. The Roman nobles isolated him from the people and worshipped him in secret. Maybe an ancestor of Hugo de Rune. Continue. They're talking about me. By freeing the country from the bite, the Grand Inquisitor will gain the adoration of the people, and with it, unprecedented political power. Archbishop Gautier's presence here says a lot. The Pope's court is worried, and so they should be. Self what? For not intervening early. The Prima Macula. On the... Ah. The Prima Macula, on the cusp of the first threshold, devours the lost carrier, or walks beside the one who tames it, Master or slave, order or chaos. But how can we be sure? What? What's that? Prima Macula, 
on the cusp of the first threshold, oh, no. devours the lost carrier, or walks beside the one who tames it, master or slave. Beatrice de Rune's research texts are all coded. But how can we be I sure? I have some good news. They finally moved her to the basement. So she's going to crack. About time. Mommy. Grand Inquisitor, the Archbishop has arrived. Perfect. Bring him in. Vitalis. Monseigneur Gautier, I trust your journey went well. Now spare me your niceties. We grow tired of your little game, Vitalis. A game, Archbishop? <laughs> Can a game change the future of the world? Listen to yourself. You have completely lost your mind. And all this is... Uh, if I may. It's important. We have the blood of Hugo de Rune. Have you tested it? Yes. Uh, alas, Monseigneur. The boy should have reached the first threshold already, but it seems something in his blood has slowed the process. The macula is still in its original state. No matter. If the books are correct, my blood and his will be bound. When he reaches the next threshold, I shall reach it with him. Proceed. But allow me to tell you the truth. You are a vile heretic driven mad by power. The Pope considers you a threat. Vitalis Benevon, you are to be excommunicated. One can excommunicate a man, Archbishop. <laughs> but not a saint. Your Inquisition is over. Meaning that a new era where puppets such as yourself will kneel and beg me to save them. He is with us. Very good. Go in 
and see whether Beatrice de Rune has regained consciousness. Same goal. We both fight the plague. Only our methods differ. Her daughter is making the same error. <sighs> Stupid. Hey, but the brother, he is unique. He might understand. Unique? I'm unique. At ease. Ad ignem. Ad lucem, sir. So, you saw the Grand Inquisitor? Yes. The blood of the carrier flows through his veins. The conjuration will take place. Splendid. The end of the plague is nigh. Indeed. But do not lower your guard. Congratulations on capturing the child. We've been after him for weeks. And then he simply turns up here asking to see his mother. Huh. <laughs> it seems he has a sense of humor. That he won't be keeping for long. I have to go and see his mother myself. What's he going to do with her? As I was telling you, this guard was devoured, but not completely. His bones were cut up and taken away by the rats. For what purpose? To incorporate them into that material we find everywhere. You mean their nests? They use our dead to build their nests. Precisely. And if we do nothing, at the rate the dead are accumulating, the nests will eventually join together to form one giant nest. It's just a matter of time. So let us pray that Vitalis' conjuration ceremony will indeed take place. Where is he? I won't find Mammy without him.
Tell me. Your new Why brothers. can't I hear you like the others? We have to transport them. You have nothing to fear from them. Meticulous crossbreeding and a little alchemy has tempered their instincts. Not to mention a, a radical change of diet. <sighs> Good. Hey, kid. <gasps> Help me. No. Help me. What's wrong with him now? Hey, no. die quietly. We're trying to work here. I'd rather he waited a little while. Rats prefer fresh meat. Damn you. You know what the hell? You and your fucking rats. Save us this rest. He's going to kill me. Your death <gasps> is not an end. For your blood shall nourish a new race of angels. They shall be your children. Your it's horrible. If she sees her son with a knife to his throat, she'll go. Lord Nicholas go past. That Darun woman is gonna suffer, I'd say. Uh, serves her right. Uh, such an educated woman. She should have joined our side. Oh no, she's way too stubborn. But no match for our torture. She must be me. He can't get out. Ah, uh, please. At least let me die out there. You wouldn't like it out there, believe me. At least here your carcass can still be of value to our alchemists. Think yourself lucky. Oh, bastard. Hey, kid. What the hell are you doing here? Magistrate Arun, for the last time, will you answer my questions? Or perhaps you're still upset about what happened to your husband. Right, our torturer will take care of you. You'll soon have your voice back, mark my words. Oh no, he's coming back. Right. Our torturer will take care of you. You'll soon have your voice back. Mark my words. Oh no, he's coming back. Hide. Mummy? Uh uh. Mummy? Hugo? But, but, so they... Amicia said you were dead, but you're not. Amicia? My darling. You must go if they find you here. No, I'm staying with you. Oh, Hugo. Did they take your blood? Oh my god. All right, Hugo. We'll go together. But you have to find the keys. They must keep them in the room at 
the end of the corridor. Can you make it there? Off you go then. Go. Be very careful. Come back as soon as you have the keys. When I return, I want everything prepared and ready to begin. Do you understand? Yes, Lord Nicholas. <laughs>